All right, well, uh, coming up uh, on Wednesday, a master plan draft will be presented to the Mobile County Commission with elements of the Mobile County's uh, Civil Rights and Cultural Heritage District. And uh, to talk about that, Anitra Bell Henderson is back with us to talk about that. She's a consultant on the plan and with the commission. And uh, this is kind of exciting, and I know you're still looking for input, right? Correct. So we have been doing this since January of 2024. Um, 100 meetings, over 400 people um, have come together, listening sessions, charrettes, uh, visioning process. And so now we finally have a draft plan, but we're always looking for input. Well, what area does this, in, does this encompass? So the district itself is between um, MLK, mm -hmm. which is the old Davis Avenue, and it centers around that space. So if you could make a square going down uh, MLK, coming back down Congress, and coming up towards um, where the Mam Gadin is located, all of that is encompassed of the uh, historic district. But the district is an experience, mm -hmm. so it has more uh, places and spaces connected to it as well. And what, what sort of things are, are you, are, have people pitched to see to, to kind of uh, envision this district? So what we heard a lot are the stories mm -hmm. that have happened, uh, stories of resilience, of course. We've heard about the historic Central High School and its um, significance in that area. All of the cemeteries, all of the funeral homes, all of the entrepreneurial experiences that happened uh, way back in the 60s of African Americans and how it was thriving, yeah. um, how wonderful it is. And then we've heard from young people what they want to see in the space, more green space, more eateries where they can actually come and enjoy themselves and their families. Mm -hmm. So it's a little bit of the past and a lot of the future uh, mixed together to have a wonderful heritage district. Oh, it sounds like a, a, a great thing. And of course, we, we have, have heard stories of, of that area and how it, MLK particularly, how it was just a thriving, just a little metropolis outside of downtown Mobile and you know, uh, uh, really thriving, a lot of businesses and uh, all that. So uh, hoping we can bring some of that back and then kind of envision the future as right. well. So uh, your chance to uh, give some input is coming up uh, this Wednesday, right? This Wednesday, the community will have an opportunity to come to Bishop State at the Gene Hayes uh, Center for Manufacturing in the large room um, at the bottom, room 122, to see the draft plan. Again, it is a draft plan, so we are looking for more ideas, and then we will present that draft plan, still in draft, to the county commission on the following day on Thursday. All right, we're looking forward to that, and uh, again, you can get your ideas out there if you're interested. 400 people already have uh, people. Uh, been involved in this, and that's that's quite a good turnout, I think. It's a lot of stories I've heard. <laughs> a lot of stories. Anitra Bell Henderson, our guest, thanks very much for being here.